Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and to those that are new to my channel, welcome also um, Today I just want to showcase what I've um, completed this week and I've painted up these cabaret miniatures to represent the 14th line chasseurs which were part of the 1st cavalry division which fought at the Battle of Victoria in 1813 these ones here um, are 18 millimeter AB miniatures there's 24 miniatures in total which makes a full size regiment um, these are organized in the same manner as my other two regiments which I posted in previous videos which was the 13th and 22nd and these ones here have the orange facings which is very similar to the 13th except for the fact that they didn't actually have a, the collar was green it didn't actually have the regimental color on the collar which is the only distinction between the two regiments um, and for tabletop purposes I've decided to um, paint the um, cloth on the bare skin there uh, with the blue just to distinguish between the two regiments with the orange facings um, just so that when you actually are playing the game you would you know, you, the person would know that these um, are a different regiment because these particular miniatures are for a commission so I thought um, I'd try and make them a little bit unique so that um, when he's playing his game, he can um, know the difference without having to uh, pick them up and, and look at them. Um, so yeah, that's what I've accomplished this week. So what I'll do now, I'll just um, try and get a little bit of um, a close-up for you guys. And just, um, as you can see, just to um, show to you that each... Um, squadron had different pom-pom colors the base of their main pom-pom as you can see here the first squadron had red except for that officer he snuck into the first squadron but he's meant to be the third but um so he had the he had one company which was solid red pom-poms with the base and then the second um, company of that same squadron um, actually had a a white center just to distinguish between the companies of the squadron and that pretty much filtered throughout the entire regiment so you had it the um, third or second squadron sorry was the um, was the green pom-pom with the white center and then at the um, the third one there was blue pom pom, and finally at the back, there was the um, the pink, or in some regiments it was orange. So now I just um, rotate this around just to show you how they look overall. I think they turned out really nice. Um, you got all the the most common coloured horse, which is the the brown. So obviously for the trumpeter which was the grey and um, with his black um, sheep's wool saddlecloth which was um, pretty much standard that didn't really change um, even though when they're on campaign you had the officer there with the green saddlecloth um, edged in silver to denote that he's a commissioned officer I think these did turn out really well and just turn it around so you can see the see them charging off so that's what i um, completed um, this week i started these on monday and finished them on friday i believe it was so i think i did um did these in a good amount of time i think they turned out quite well as you can see the the, the sash on the officer is white with a with the um, regimental colour pot down the centre. 
and um, I think the client will be very happy with these um, if you do like these um, please like comment and subscribe and to um, click that bell as I'll be posting another two uh, videos um, or another two regiments which I need to complete which will be the the 26th um, line Jesser's and also the 3rd um, Regiment of Hussars which is also part of this 1st Cavalry Division which fought on the Battle of Victoria ok guys thanks for stopping by and um, watching this update on um, what I've done so far for this commission um, and I'll catch you next time take care bye for now